Curtis Aikens is a man who went through high school, a year of college, and into the world of business without being able to read. Recently, the pain of illiteracy came back to him in front of millions of television viewers. The recipe and the produce we have today for you is okay. peaches. Peaches. I love Curtis Aikens does grocery segments for the home show. He's been a grocer for years and ran a produce company in San Francisco. But amazingly, Curtis could not read until he was 26. One day last month on the home show, when he was co-hosting a segment with Sarah Purcell on closed captioning, he had problems reading the teleprompter and broke down live on the air. The National Help Me. That captioning? Word, captioning Institute has found that by hearing and seeing words, so much. You're doing great. Oh, Curtis, you're doing wonderfully well. Do you want me to finish it for you? Please. Okay. Aiken says he suddenly had a flashback to his illiterate days and couldn't read. I asked Sarah what to help me with that word because she knows of my reading history. And then I, I, it just flashed on me. Here I am, 33, and I can't read again. And I just, I couldn't, couldn't hang. Aikens claims this is the only time since he learned to read seven years ago that this has happened. I thought, oh, God, this whole segment, this is what I've been working for for three years in television, was to speak out for reading for that 30 million Americans, English-speaking Americans who can't read. And here I am. I'm going to embarrass them again. Aikens had to fake reading skills throughout his job and his life until he finally overcame his shame and called a literacy program. And said, uh, I can't read. I want to learn how to read. And a flood of emotion came out because I never told anyone this. Curtis says his on-air breakdown ended up being a positive thing because viewers saw the emotional impact of illiteracy. He says he's received hundreds of supportive phone calls and letters. I guess this was my purpose. Now I get a chance to, to bring all those people that are in that darkness of illiteracy into the light of reading. Last year, Curtis Aikens wrote a book, The Green Grocer's Guide to the Harvest, with half the proceeds from the sale of that book going to adult literacy programs. With the Democratic convention coverage available all across the cable channels, a lot of people...